Welcome to the 14th episode of Let's Play Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice. This episode is entitled, Oh My God. And you'll see why in a minute. So, in the previous episode, I was able to defeat a general who was a mini-boss. Uh, the episode before that, I was finally able to take down the, K the Chained Ogre, also a mini-boss. And in the episode before that, I took down the Shinobi Hunter, also a mini-boss. I have yet to face an honest-to-God, full-on boss in this game. They've all been mini-bosses, and a couple of them, the Chained Ogre specifically, has given me fits. But now I'm down here, following this path, and... Alright, what's that? What's that? Why is everything rumbling? Ever since I went exploring earlier, and saw what looked like the skin of a something, like a snake or something, hanging off of a tree, and it was a lot of skin, I've been a little worried about going down in these areas. Let's see, nothing down there. This is the way to go, unless I want to go to that other way, which I think has a headless in it, based on the note. I'm hesitant to go anywhere near anything like that. Okay, there's a pathway there. Let's hop down. Okay, we'll go down here. So far, uh, grab, 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 yes. Alright, let's get over there. Okay. Let's see if I can head over. Oh. Okay. Can I hide? Nope. Shit. Right, maybe I need to go over there. What is the. Oh, God. There he is. Is that a. What is that thing? Oh, Jesus, it's a snake. Oh, sweet God. That thing is huge. Alright. Let's try to get over here where he's not looking and hide in the bushes. Okay. Is there anything in these bushes? Maybe some snake repellent. Oh, God. Jeez. I remember back in the day, say early 2000s or so, if you ever had something like this on screen, all it was was something to kind of set the tone. You couldn't actually interact with it or anything like that. This, I think, is very, very different. This may be the biggest thing I've ever seen from Software Create. Alright, he's not looking. Let's make a run for it. Grapple time. Let's run in here. Not. Damn, no. Run. There we go. I'm guessing he saw me and tried to come after me over there and probably couldn't fit through the hole. Alright, I feel safe in here for at least a minute, but I'm gonna have to get back. I'm either fighting this snake or I'm sneaking past this snake. I don't know which. All I do know is I don't like either aspect very well, but sneaking past sounds better right now. I mean, I feel like this is extremely early game. There is no way I can take on something like that. Now let's see if we can... Oh god, there he is! Whoa, there he is. God, he's huge. Okay. So do I need to sneak? I think I need to sneak past him. That looks like high grass over there. Of course, he's looking directly this way. Really? You don't have anything better to look at? Alright, let, let's see what he does. Okay, he's going past, and he's turning around, okay. This might be the opportunity if I can follow him before he turns back around and get to where I need to go. Here we go. Alright, go. There he is. Okay, I gotta see if I can use these. Ow! 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 Wait a minute. I didn't take any damage from that. He is a physical object in the world, but just bumping into him does not alert him, apparently. Because he's so big, you probably wouldn't notice it. I mean, <laughs> I'm about the size of a tick to him. But also, it seems like it, it isn't hurting me. It's more just the, oh, the rough scales. But it is definitely an interactive object. Okay. Where do I go from here? That looks like a ledge behind that ice. 
He's looking away. I'm gonna try to go in there. Right, here we go. So I'm at the ledge, and there's these ice sheets in front of me that might make it harder for him to see me. Okay. What is that? Is that a little building? And he was right above me. Good God. Whoa. Is that? That might have been treasure. Okay, now I'm gonna. What's the point of the building? Unless that's a place for me to hide. But I need to figure out how to get to that treasure too. Thanks, From Software, for making this a more complicated situation than I thought it was. So I'm well further in the game than this right now, but I just can't get over the size of my health bar back then. Okay, there. I think this is my opportunity to make a run for it. Let's get over there to that building. Okay, unstep. Ah, oh, darn it! I stepped right back to the wall, and I'm not going to take any chance. I'm going to hide again. Discretion is the better part of valor. Okay, he's looking away. Here we go. Okay, I'll hide in the hut. He'll never find me in here. Probably used to it being here and doesn't really pay that much attention. And he goes, oh, crap. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here goes. Oh. This man's really stupid. That'll teach him. Ah, snap seed. Go, 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 Grapple across, jump down, there he is. Alright, grapple across again. Run in here. Go, 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 go. Drop down. Jump down there. Now he's still flashing around. I imagine if I had one of my eyes to poke down. Oh god! Ah! Uh, oh! Grab it! Got it. Let's go, let's hurry. Stay hidden just in case. the ledge. Jesus. Awesome. I'm gonna try to get out of the way. Well, hopefully this time I won't fall. That didn't look like a fall like that's the edge of the ramp. go that way. That looked like an ice cream up. Go, 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 go. Grab, grab, grab. Here we go. And we're gonna come across here. Go the road. No, I almost did it again. Here we go. Oh, God! Woo! Crap, grapple point, grapple point! Okay, here we go. Run, 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 run. Oh, up here. Oh my, okay. Woo! That was more than a little bit intense. I mean, you stupid snake, at least we got past you. I hope I don't have to fight him later. <laughs> that would be just, I don't know if I, I mean, it better be like really late game. Okay, lots of grapple points here. We're heading somewhere. Another one up there. What are you? Hey, treasure. Alright, let's go check out the treasure. Echo sugar. And a dead end. Except here. Can I jump and grab that? I can. And what's up here? Okay, there's a rifleman up. Oh, crap. Those big ones. In what looks like a Hawaiian shirt or a badly fitting kimono. Okay, I'm gonna leave them alone right now. Hmm. Let's head back over here, see if there's something before I go in there. Aha! Sculptor's idol and an item. Dotch and sugar. Anything hiding behind you? Nope. Anything hiding on the other side of you? Nope. Okay, time to rest. Alright, 
so I think that area I just saw a minute ago is probably one of those open areas with a good bit of enemies. Kind of like the one we found the general in. Maybe there's another mini boss in there. Maybe there's a real boss nearby. Maybe it's just an open area to work through. Which is kind of what I'm hoping for right now. So let's see. I've got my loaded axe, my firecrackers, my flame vent. I'm going to put the world one slash on. Just looking at some of these items, so I have a gourd that will heal burning. Divine confetti. Snap seeds. Night jar monocular. Light corn purse, and of course a homeward idol. Okay. I think this is where I had uh, cut the footage and I came back another day to play. So I'm starting over here. I'm going to go ahead and see now what is in that area. Not this way, but behind me. Just checking though, making sure there's nothing there useful. Alright, let's see what's over here. Let, so can I grapple up to that? Yep. And here we go. Spider Monk. I mean, Spider Ninja, or whatever I am. Okay. So, there's a tree over there. There's a treasure. It looks like a dude over there. Let's, down there is a guy. He looks like the one standing by the stairs. He looks like a guy with a rifle. Two guys talking. Let's eavesdrop. Smoke signal from the Great Castle Gate. Is it Lord Yobu? Yes. That's definitely Yobu the Demon. Oh, she not safe so long as that man guards her doors. Lord Yobu guards the door. That is either a setup for a mini boss or a boss boss. Okay, I could grapple up to that. I know there are at least five guys here. This rifleman here. Another one further down in that building. The big dude. The two people talking. And the guy up by the tree that looked like he was sitting down. So actually that makes six things. Whoops. Nice. That's why I'm a ninja. You know, that that's what you call ninja skills. Alright, double jump, or how about we just grab one? Now let's try this again. Shimmy, 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 shimmy. Whoop, there we go. Some more shimmy. Yeah, there's a guy right there. What, what's he doing? Hmm. Does he just stand there? Nope, he's patrolling too. So you got the big guy patrolling and him. So never mind, there's seven dudes here. Skipped ahead with my footage there a little bit. I'm thinking I want to take out the big guy as quickly as possible. Oh, he walks down there. Crud. Alright. Oops. Dang it. Alright. But we did have that other guy walk by here. Let's see if I can grapple. Alright, there's a guy in that building. Looks like he's a gunner. There's the other gunner. Do I want to make a move up into that building? Oh, here's this guy. Okay, I'm locked on. Can I ledge kill him? Yep, see ya. Alright, that's one down. Okay, I am seriously thinking about going for that building. Taking out the rifleman. Big guy incoming. He's not looking. If I'm gonna do this, I better do it. Here we go. Here we go, and rifleman down. Okay. 
Now let's see. When's Big Dog coming by? They sound close. I think I just saw him come by the window. Wait, I, I can see their shadow. There they are. There they are. Okay. I can still stealth theft blow them. As tough as they are one on one, the stealth mechanic does balance things out if you do it well. At least for things like this. For real bosses, I don't know how much it'll really help, but he's just a big dead dude. Yeah, there you go. Alright, none of them have noticed me yet. Okay, can I sneak up behind Rifleman Guy? Sneak up behind him. Got you too. Now what? Let's follow this around. Ooh, treasure. Hungo sugar. Hmm. Can I get up here? Oh, these are dead bodies. Oh, it is a war after all. And I'm walking on them. I'm such a nice person. What's over here? Oh, a plummeting death. We'll say no then. Let's see if I can jump across here. Uh, I might be able to make that. Let's try again. Got it. Okay, we'll climb it. Let's to try this one. But the Interior Ministry's army is far too powerful. And that is why you wish to use the power of my blood. It doesn't matter how much power you obtain. You'll keep on fighting until you're a monster, incapable of feeling pain or fear. I do not wish to corrupt the lives of men. Look at this mountain of bodies. Ashina cannot be defended by normal means. Not anymore. I could never be as strong as you, Lord Kenichiro. I do not yet know what it is I should do. It has been a long time since that happened. Wait all you'd like. It'll do you no good. Okay, so Genishiro and uh, Kuro talk a good bit. Kuro's a prisoner, but he's also treated with some level of respect. But Genishiro has his own plans, and he doesn't care what Kuro wants to do. Okay, what's up here? Okay, can I take these guys down? I think I see some treasure over there. There's one. Can I jump assassinate him from here? I'm thinking I can't. One thing, at this point in the game, I'm still not able to take on two guys at once. I need to be able to... Oh, don't crash. That didn't work. Ow, ow, ow. There's one. Spear and done. Yes. Alright, grab the treasure. What are you? Ceramic shard. Mimbo's balloon. Heavy coin purse. Hole in the wall. Okay. Looks like I cleared this area out, except for there was that guy up there by the tree. There might be some more up in the upper levels, but... I'm in decent shape. Do I keep moving forward? Let's see. Hide right here. Here. 
No. Right, there's the guy by the tree. Alright. Let's sneak up on him. Jump up here. Oh, eavesdrop. A little bit of gunpowder, and he was startled, and now he's dead. Animals don't handle gunpowder, or what we like to call fireworks. Ah! Oops. Very well. I know you from software. I think you're giving me a hint. I mean, they're going to have a big old bunch... There's another card. I mean, they're going to have a big old bunch of animals to deal with in a minute. Boss. Hey, boss. Some sort of an animal. Full of ash. Okay, where's he going? More treasure up here. Anybody in this doorway? No. Okay, where are you? Pellet. Are you a door that can't open from this side? Let's see. Okay, we're gonna drop assassinate this guy. And I totally missed. Thankfully, he didn't notice me. And he's dead. Okay. Now what? Looks empty. Let's go up on this tree. Yeah, I don't see anything. I don't think I've missed anything. Can I grapple up to that? No, but I can to there. Whoa. Okay, I can't go further up here. That big field down there almost looks like if one of those, um, if this were Dark Souls, that's a if you fall off, you're dead situation. But that looks interactive. There's stairs leading into it. Okay, let's check this building. But I think I know what that is down there. I think we might be dealing with a boss arena. Let's check up. No, did it. I think that might be a boss arena. <clears throat> we may be about to face our first boss. Let's see. If it is a boss arena, it's a really big boss arena. Can I, nope, can't grapple there. That would be a really big boss area, but it just feels like one. From software. Nope, definitely can't grapple up there. Okay. We may be about to encounter a boss. And I heard crows calling. That tells me there may be a merchant nearby. I think I'm going to go back. Before I go in there, I'm going to go back to the sculptor's idol, make sure I'm ready, because I have a feeling this is a boss fight. So next episode, we are going to face our first major boss. At least I'm almost positive. They've hinted at it. I have a funny feeling firecrackers will come in handy. Until then, I think I'm, I'm going to rest here. I want to be in the right frame of mind to take this thing on. Go ahead and make sure I have the right gear. But I hope you enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. 
where we saw a very big stake. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And next episode, Boss Fight. Peace out.